Hi there, welcome to Vlogmas 2022. If you've not been here before, hello, my name is Hannah and I'm going to be posting a video every single day in December. I am a yarn dyer and I make beaded stitch markers and uh, I'm a full-time small business owner owning my own business, The Corner of Craft. If you'd like to follow me on social media, links can all be found in the description box below. You know the drill. Today is Wednesday, the 23rd of November, and I know I am filming this way in advance. My parents are coming up today, the first week of December, and I wanted to focus on spending time with them instead of um, worrying about if I have enough footage filmed and then finding the time to edit the footage and all of that fun stuff. So we're starting today. Starting a bit later in the day as it's currently 20 past 12 and the reason I'm starting a bit later in the day because all you missed this morning was me sorting out my finances in my pajamas and also I, what else did I do? Oh I've just recorded Friday's video, I've literally just finished it. I did this makeup look whilst chatting advent patterns. So that is what you missed this morning and that is why I'm off to a later start. Today's plan of action. The sun is currently shining, even though it's absolutely chucking it down with rain. I'm off to the theatre this evening with my sister and her fiance and my husband, whose name is Mario. And uh, we are off to see White Christmas. Very excited. This was my birthday present to my sister. No, this was my gift to my sister for her birthday. That makes more sense. I just thought it'd be a fun festive thing to do. But I need to go into Nottingham a little bit early because I need to go to the bank. Turns out, since I started my business, my bank changed the fact that you can't use your personal account as a business account and I'd missed that transition happening so they've discovered it and they're closing my bank account next month so I need to open another bank account. I already have another business bank account sorted but I need another personal bank account sorted. Also it's about time that I get all my names changed on my um, bank details because at the moment they're still in my maiden name. so. Might also have a peruse around the Christmas markets. I'm going to take some stuff into bead weave. I'm going to camp out in a coffee shop and bead weave because I have a shop update on the 3rd of December and currently I have very little to go in it. So it is time for a little advent opening. Very exciting. I, right, the advent calendars I have... Oh, brew, I need to put a jumper on. The advent calendars that I have this year is my own uh, yarn advent calendar which is chromatic yarns uh, all of my yarn is dyed in colors inspired by Dungeons and Dragons I have my bird and blend tea advent calendar which I have almost every year I will say I'm very lucky in that they sent this to me this was gifted to me I'll pop a link in the description box um, it's an affiliate link if they have any left by the time I post this if you fancy one and then I also have this one I bought um, Castle View Yarns advent calendar which was mermaid themed so I had to have one and then Mario has a pork scratching advent calendar but he's not going to be opening it today because today is November the 23rd. I'm opening them today because vlogmas. Also what a great excuse. <laughs> right let's get my number one out. Is that one? That's a one. Oh her stickers are so lovely. Very nice. And then let's get my number one out of here. So in the bird and blend advent like last year, you get two tea bags. So whilst I'm opening it now, I'm also going to be able to have a tea bag on the 1st of December as well. That was the excuse. And then here's mine. Doo -doo. Right, oh, I don't know where to start. Let's start with my own, because I know what it is. It's, it's not as exciting, but I like to wrap it up anyway. But this is Fireball. Fireball. Beep. Um, and yeah, it's fun reds and oranges and very vibrant. I love it. And also you get a four-sided, I'm holding this above with my cup of tea, that's precarious, isn't it? Fun four-sided dice. Let's focus in, focus in, focus in, thank you. Purple with gold numbers. Very, very nice. So I've decided with my advent I'm going to be knitting the quest shawl in which you roll two six-sided dice and I don't think I'm going to be able to start mine today. It's very frustrating. So next up we have the Bird and Blend advent and it says what tea is on the back and this one is doo -doo -doo -doo, gingerbread chai. So festive. So festive. I need to have a go at making this again because I always say that this tea is too spicy for me. 
But I think I just need to give it another go and maybe just put a bit more milk in it. And you don't have to have it with milk and yeah. And like it's a staple tea and they love it and they have it all the time. Um, it's like it's, it's there year round, it's not just Christmas. So maybe I just need to give it another shot because for me it was too spicy for a chai. Next up we have the Castle View Yarns Advent which is the lovely Jen. I haven't decided what to make with this yet. If you watched Friday's video, then I said that I might do a dot sweater with it because I think it would be really nice. The only thing holding me back is the fact it's held with mohair and I'm gonna have to find vaguely coordinating mohair. I mean, I could always dye some up, I suppose. I am a yarn dyer after all. Oh, it feels like there's an extra goodie in here. <gasps> oh, oh, beautiful. This is beautiful. Right, let me just tuck this end in. I got the sock, which is 75% um, superwash merino, 25% nylon. And um, I'm just tucking the ends in, because that's who I am. So this is Maya the Ocean Mermaid. And you get this lovely stitch marker. From the name, I thought it was gonna be blue. It's not, it's a lovely pink color with delicate speckles. absolutely beautiful the speckles of blue and then there's some oh there's some more vibrant pink and um, a bit of peach and I think this is spun into the wool yes it is um and yeah oh so pretty really lovely oh Jen I like that oh I'm so excited for this advent now now Jen's advent is a fade um I'm just gonna double check the name I don't want to spoil it and see all the other ones yeah, so this is Maya Ocean Tide. Oh my goodness, she's got a thing which is what's your mermaid name? So you need the first letter of your name, H, Angelica, and the month of your birth, September, Glitter Reef. Angelica, Glitter Reef. Oh, I love that. That's so cute. That's so cute. How cute. Right, I'm going to pop this back in here. You know what? Organza bag, very good shout. Might have to nab that for next year. I'm going to pop this back in its little baggie. So I remember what order it goes in, because uh, yeah, going out this evening, I'm not going to be able to knit anything, and plus I want to open a few of these before I decide what I'm going to be casting on, but oh, beautiful, beautiful, how exciting, I love Vlogmas. So if you are in the Biscuit Brew crew on Patreon, you would have already seen this pouch. This is my beading on the go pouch, beading on the go, and this is the pouch that I take out when I bead on the go, as the name suggests. So in this pouch, I have my bead mat that just kind of lives in there, that bead mat, because the other one's on a tray with loads of stuff on it. I pack uh, needles of a couple of different sizes. I usually only use a size 10, but sometimes you need a size 12 to fit through those beads. I make sure I have my scissors, my beading thread, and then it's just a case of finding the beads that I actually want. I very optimistically, too optimistically, packed way too many beads. I brought beads to make bears and Christmas hats, uh, Father Christmases, Christmas puddings, and poinsettias, and you will see later in this video, I did not get that all done at all. So, but better to be over prepared than underprepared, and I'm just gonna make sure that I have everything with me, including beads for the loop and the little cuticle cutter I use to cut my thread. So uh, yeah, that's what's in my bead pouch. So a jumper has gone on. This is my Garden Gate sweater by Jennifer Steingass. And very nice, very good, very nice. And I received a parcel. It is a prize donation for the um, Advents of December's past uh, knit along, knit and crochet along. So we have, ooh, some form of little sweet of some form, not 100% sure, but delicious. This is a jasmine tea and a Christmas tea. And then we have a gorgeous bag. Now this is by Ellen, who is Mrs. Lamb um, Yarns. And oh, this is so nice. Oh my God, it gets better. Okay, uh, it's this lovely um, project bag. Oh, it's by Kalukshek Ellen. Oh, you can smell that. Because it's laser cut, you can smell the wood. But Mrs. Lambs is her yarn line, but um, bags might be separate. So let's do a close-up of that so you can see that. 
And then it's this beautiful festive fabric. It's a drawstring bag. You know I love a drawstring. And it's got a really great arm strap so you can knit on the go or as you're stood. And the fabric inside is fairy lights. It's amazing. It's amazing. So I've got a couple of prizes lined up and um, yeah, I'll be picking the winners. Um, well, I mean, technically I would, it, it will be in a few days, um, but timelines are off. So <laughs> I also changed my glasses. I don't know how I feel about these glasses. I always wear the ones with the heavier rims. So now I don't know how I feel about these, but this bag is absolutely beautiful. Great for a shawl. Fabulous. I will pop Ellen's details in the uh, description box. So if you want to check out their stuff, please feel free and I'll send all the goodies with it too. I'll pop them in. Right, little update. So I have packed up some beads to take with me so I can do some bead weaving in town. I need to go to the bank because I need to change my name in my bank accounts and also open a new bank account. I've also just remembered it's local election voting day so I'm gonna go and vote on my way into town. Um, because I do an in-person vote because I quite like doing an in-person vote. Mary has got a postal vote but of course he hasn't posted it off so I have to take it with me. Thank goodness I do. <laughs> Thank goodness I do in-person voting. And uh, yeah, then I'm going to go and get the tram into town. It's currently quarter to two. Um, the sun is already setting, it's already getting dark. I mean it's not getting dark, it's still quite light outside but... Right. Let's go. I have voted, huzzah. I obviously couldn't show you any of the vote because I don't think that's legal. I don't know. Um, but I did my little cross on my little bit of paper. Now I'm gonna go to the tram stop and head to town. I headed into town, I got the tram for the first time in a very long time. A lot of the towns around Nottingham had coal mines that they were all closed in the 80s, um, thanks to Margaret Thatcher. And uh, yeah, so there's a lot of coal mining things around. This is the sock that I'm working on for Mario. I'd pulled the needle out, of course I have. I have successfully picked up all bar one stitch, uh, which I then fixed and managed to turn the heel, pick up the stitches down the side, all in the tram ride. That is how long the tram ride into town now is. Um, but now I'm in Nottingham, yes. I haven't gone in to have a proper mooch around town for so long so I obviously had to pay a visit to Bird and Blend because I needed some more tea. Got some carrot cake and salted caramel Lebkuchen, nipped to the bead shop, just went to all my favourite haunts, um, admired their wall of delicate beads which I didn't need, I just needed some jump rings and uh, I bought something else. Five mil, no, oh, that's what I wanted, five mil jump rings and some oh, gold plated um, Delica beads is what I wanted. And then I headed to Nero. Now as I was pouring my beads and I'd bought a tea and I'm sat in the window because they had no seats. Um, oh, I successfully opened my bank account. Wonderful, fine. Everything took longer than I thought it was going to because of course it did. Uh, I got a text from Mario and my sister, her name is Charlotte, uh, to say that they were heading in. Uh, two separate text messages. Mario was just parking up and then Charlotte had just come in so they asked where I was, so I got one stitch marker made. Just the one, oh, there he is, that's my handsome husband. Just the one. Um, and then finished my tea, went for a look around the Christmas market. So festive, we'll say, not as nice as a German Christmas market in Germany, but you take what you can get, like this terrifyingly creepy Santa trying to sell me Belgian waffles. No, it's terrifying. Uh, but I do like that the lights on the City Hall change to rainbow from blue. Here we are in Victoria Centre, which is the shopping centre in town. It's celebrating 50 years of existing, I'm guessing, but I just like all the sparkly lights. Then we headed to the uh, Theatre Royal in Nottingham and went to see White Christmas. I always couldn't film any of that because, you know, you can't. And here we are, ta-da! all squished in the theatre. Hey folks, we have some terribly unflattering lighting because I don't have a ring light. It is currently 22.11 and we have just got home from seeing White Christmas. Oh, it was so good. I really enjoyed it. It's put me in a right festive mood. I love um, like musicals like that. And yeah, I think everyone enjoyed it, which was absolutely lovely. Such a good, such a good time, such a good time. I managed to get everything done in town, ticking all the boxes, getting stuff done. Didn't make many stitch markers at all though. A bit unfortunate, but hey, such is life. Sometimes you've got to go out and have a nice time. Anyway, 
I'm gonna go because this lighting is absolutely awful. Thank you so, so much for watching. I truly hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please feel free to give it a thumbs up and to subscribe. I'm gonna be posting here every single day in the month of December. I know I didn't make a tea today, I'm very sorry. I'll be back on it tomorrow. Um, yes, so it'd be lovely if you were to stick around. That would be delightful. If you want to join the Discord, we have a Discord. Link and can be found in the description box below along with anything else that I think you might need. And uh, yeah, if you'd like to leave me a comment, that would be delightful. The daily check-in, we love to see it. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching everyone. Happy Vlogmas, Vlogmas has commenced and I will see you very soon in tomorrow's video. Bye.